puck on the end wall. Yamamoto there for Spokane. Comes free. Now, middle of the ice. Yamamoto poked off his stick. Comes free to Smith. Smith comes up. Right side to McAdoo. Back to Yamamoto. Yamamoto fires a shot and scores! Tyler Yamamoto, after going down at center ice, joins the rush and snaps home his 17th of the year at Spokane with a 1-0 lead, 13-18 remaining in the first period. may have heard the fans booing in the background. They felt he had been tripped up trying to make a play out of his own D zone. And he got back up, joined the rush, got the puck, walked in right circle and snapped one past Grant. 17th of the year at 642. Great face off. Here's the voice of your Spokane Chiefs, Mike Boyle. Welcome back, everyone, as we drop the puck for period number two. Anderson Dolan's line out there for Spokane. As they come from left to right, Anderson Dolan, a shot from the left side, blocked away. Comes out to Smith, left circle, fires a shot, and he scores! Ty Smith with the wrister from the left blue line. And 12 seconds into this second period, the Chiefs now lead it 3-0. Ty Smith with his 11th goal of the season as he gets the rebound off the Anderson Dolan shot. And puts it home to give Spokane a three-goal lead. Well, you couldn't draw it up any better in the locker room as to how you want to start a period. As Anderson Dolan, who just had a 10-game point streak snapped on Tuesday, gets from the left point. Yamamoto out front with Anderson Dolan and McAdoo. Kicks it back to Smith, and Smith, who got the goal, will take it to the red line and chuck it in. Chiefs on the offensive. Lacusta back there for Prince George. Bangs it off the board. Rolling puck. Leopard gets to it. He'll carry it up the left side, but Smith backtracking, able to take it away. Rims it around. McIndoe going to chip it up the left side. Went off a Prince George stick, so no icing as the puck crosses the goal line. Boyd is back. Leaves it out center of the ice. Crawl keeps it in. Crawl puts it right circle. Leopard back there for Prince George. Now Schottler leaves it behind the net. Anderson Dolan breaks it up, gets it to Yamamoto, out to Smith at the blue line. Smith looking, walks it to the point, now comes left side. Smith holds it, comes in out front, backhander, and he scores! Ty Smith walked right in and backhanded it top shelf, and Spokane with a 4 nothing lead, 15-58 to go in the second. from Prince George went after Ty Smith. He just carried the puck and walked right on in and put on a clinic on how to shoot a backhander. Smith is second of the period, 12th of the season at 4.02 of this second period. Tyler Yamamoto will get the lone assist. At as here comes Reinhardt up the right side. A frack going to steal it back for Spokane. Now Smith stretched pass ahead for Toporowski. Comes across the blue line. Snaps a shot and scores! Lose Toporowski! And Spokane with a 5 nothing lead. 11.37 to go here in the second. Great pass by Ty Smith. He set that up with a beautiful stretch pass right in stride. Toporowski able to come down that right side unimpeded and scores his ninth of the season. 8.23 of this second period. As Ty Smith with three points here in the second. Milos Pafrak will also get an assist. He's got a two-point night going. Chiefs a 5-0 lead as we approach the midway point of this second period. Now crawl. Up the left side, fires it in. Smith with it. Back over to Crawl. Tipped ahead, Zumak. Zumak out front, trying to pull the trigger, taken away. Comes out to Crawl at the blue line. Off his skate, and O'Brien will field it. O'Brien up ice, will dump it down. Mazer checked by Smith. Locker room. I'm sure he's arguing that he's fine, but anytime you see a head go into the wall, Trainer's going to make sure as the puck shot down by the Cougars. 
into the Chiefs zone. Now it's Brown, left corner, ridden on by Faith. Chorney gets the loose puck, finds Ty Smith. Ships it up the wall, beyond the blue line. McKay trying to get it up ice, gets it to Chorney. Chorney charging out front, trying to stop, and he scores! Hunter Chorney, as he puts Spokane ahead, 7-1, with 14.02 left to go in the third period. Jorns with his second career goal. As he just got some speed, came down that left side and able to get it in by 58 of the third period. Shorty giving Spokane a 7-1 to one edge. Now Anderson Dolan's line back out there for Spokane. As McKay will get one of the assists on that Shorty goal as Bethune throws it towards the net. They made by Weatherill. They'll hang on to it along the left post. McKay and Smith with the assist. Ty Smith now a five-point night. Ty Smith, two goals, three assists this evening. It's a career-high night for Ty Smith. Spokane, a 7-1 lead. Puck back. Smith over to Helgeson. Yamamoto back for Helgeson. Miscommunication there. As Yamamoto has to go back for the puck. Leaves it for Smith. Up the left side. Anderson Dolan, free left circle. Out front, a shot, and a score! Ethan McIndoo with a one-timer. And Spokane now an 8-1 to lead with 13.30 to go here in the third. Someone threw some hats out on the ice. Pretty good for Mac's first goal of the evening. McIndoo will get his 19th of the year. 6.30. The time of the goal, 32 seconds after Torney's go. It's McIndoo from Anderson Nolan. And who else? Smith, six-point night now. Adrian there. He'll bang it off the glass down the ice, and Hamillick back for Spokane. Bends it around to Anderson Dolan. AD going to carry it across the blue line. Drop pass to I. Smith. Fire the shot in the wrist or gloved by Delora, and he'll hang on with 7.16 left in the third period. We've hit the midway point of this one. Let's take a minute timeout. Spokane leading at 8 to 1 as you're listening to Chief Fox. I was devastated. They hugged me. They reminded me I had the right coverage. I cried all over again. They're friends. They're real. They make us feel like family. Coming together to make life better. Get started at numericacu.com. Welcome back, everyone. Chiefs nearly put one in the net as a shot from Smith. A tip out front. The score! Jeff Faith getting the tip on a Ty Smith shot. And Spokane now with a 9-1 to lead. Now this is the funny part. Faith is not going to the bench to be the lead guy to take credit for the goal. He wants Smitty to get the hat trick. Pretty sure it went off of Faith or out front. I just waved him off and said, no, that's your goal. Chiefs now with a 9 to 1 lead. 13-04. Try to keep it in the knocked away. And here's Toporowski to lead feed. He can't handle the puck bouncing down the ice. Ball horn left corner. Rims the puck for the winning team of Dubé. Dubé jams it now to Connor Brugge. Kate, he's away right side center. Brugge Kate back inside the zone. Has it right corner. He'll try to shield away Helgensen. Helgensen takes body on Brugge Kate. Puck sitting loose. One now by Ty Smith. He'll move it out of center. Pass on left wing. Alana. He'll move in. He'll feed out to Smith. Smith with the chance. In for Toporowski. They score! Ty Smith will find the back of the net. Bluebirds were out, and they're not cheering for him at all. As he gives Spokane a 2-1 lead. This goal, five minutes and a second in period number three. As Smith is pleased, as are the rest of the Chiefs and the occasional Chief fan in the building, but as far as that goes, 
a big goal for the Spokane Chiefs at an opportune time, just five minutes and one second into this third period. And they grab the lead. Chances have been tough to come by for the Rockets. They'll have to step it up here in the last 15. A corner and gathered up here by McGrew. McGrew stapled to the sideboard by Bruggen Kate. McGrew stays with the puck though, moves it right side center. McGrew back in. McGrew, deep right corner, lost the puck to Ballhorn, who got it out of Cowell. He'll send out to Matson. Matson left side center, gains the red line, and he'll backhand it in. 90 seconds away from overtime and a 2 2 tie. Ty Smith back on the goal, moves the puck right side center. Here goes McGrew back in, tries to make a move. Big hand save, another chance, they score! Elnick is second of the game with 1.14 left in regulation time. Spokane, a 3-2 lead. Is that the dagger tonight? Well, the Chiefs were pressing. They've had some opportunities. Porters come up big, but Elnick left alone to swoop in right down the middle of the ice and get the rebound. Porter makes the first save. He can't really fault him on that one. We're without the video replay on our side of the rink as that computer board is blown out. But that's about what happened. Melanox is the right place, right time, big 20. Nice through Harrison. Couldn't get it by him. Puck into the right corner, taken by Ross again. Ross coming up left side, out to the blue line to crawl. Swings it over to Smith. Smith with it, pivots, gets hooked down there by Lowen. Penalty coming. Crawl going to tee it up. Left circle, snaps the shot. Go! Into the Hawks zone. Takes a wide on Takshara. Down below the goal line now. Towards the right point for Smith. Smith looks towards the goal. His shot. Not sure. I think, but it, I think it's Smith's goal. Chiefs have tied it. 8.29 left in the second period. Hawks on one end. That close to going up by two. Weather will big save. And Spokane comes right back. So might hit a Portland player on the way to the net. But Ty Smith the first through the celebration line. I think it's going to be his goal, the third of the postseason. As the Chiefs rimmed it around the near side boards, lots of traffic going to the front of the net. And it wound up beating Kaler high to the glove hand side. Hard to see from that angle. Yamamoto was out front. Wow. I tell you what, I just watching that, Yamamoto's outside the crease, he's setting a screen, and Kaler took his leg and put it in between Yamamoto's. Now, is that the offensive player's fault? Helgeson will send it out to the blue line. That's just not a good call. Here comes Helgeson ahead for Anderson Dolan. Cross the blue line, drop pass Helgeson, back to Smith. Smith turns for a shot, and scores! Ty Smith! Top shelf, and the Chiefs get it back as he scores with 12.08 to go in the second. It's now 3 1 Spokane. Chiefs go on the rush, and Smith gets his first of the playoffs, his first career playoff goal, 15th of the season overall. 7.52, the time of the goal, as it'll be Helgeson and Anderson Dolan with the assist. Fight for the puck, it's won by Portland. Chalowski sends it up to the blue line, kept in by Ty Smith. For Elenick. Puck comes free to Smith at the blue line. Over to Anderson Dolan, left side, back to Smith. Smith looking, turns, fires, shot, save, rebound in front. It's still loose. Elenick with a shot, and a save made somehow as the net was open. Puck comes free out to the blue line to Smith. Over to Yamamoto. Boy, how that did not go in for Elenick, I will never know. Elenick over on the right side to Yamamoto. Over to Smith. Anderson Dolan, left side, out front, tip. McAdoo, Joseph, scores! Ethan McAdoo, free on the far post. And Spokane now leads it 4-1 with 6-10 to go in the second period. Power play goal for Ethan McIndoo. For Mac, that is second of these playoffs. Here we go, Overhard on the dots. Face off. Yokohari plays it to the line and it gets out, no icing. McKenzie, he's got the empty net, sharp angle. He's gonna pin it up against the boards on the far side, taken down. Couldn't get a good look at the goal and out the other way come the Chiefs with 50 seconds remaining. Woods into the Hawks zone, takes it wide on Tech Shera, leaves it below the goal line. Overhard on the backhand, 
Rims it around the boards near side, Glass. Can't get it out, Reed. Down the half wall, it comes below the goal line, in front, Allen, it's stopped by Taylor. Play towards the line, Smith holds. Smith, near side to Reed, his shot hits the body and it's in. Over Hart, trying to block it, ends up going off him, past Kaler, and with 30.7 seconds remaining, the Chiefs have tied it. Heartbreak for the Hawks. Desperation for Spokane, and Kaler made an outstanding save on Ellen a seconds before. And Reed threw it, and Overhart, who's been so good in the series, went for the block, it hit him up high in the chest pad, and off the arm and in behind Kaler. And we are tied at four with 30 seconds left. First Avista power play for every power play goal this year. Avista will donate $25 to Project Share, helping families stay warm. The only goal of Project Share as Spokane with the puck. They bring it in the attack zone. Yamamoto, left side to Elenick. Elenick moves to the point, now drops it off for Smith. Smith at the point. Top right circle, Anderson Dolan. Back to Smith. Yamamoto's over on the left side. They go to Anderson Dolan, right circle. Over to Smith. Smith turns, fires just wide right. Rebound, loose up, but, and it's kicked in by Elenick. And a goal. We will see if it stands up. 10.59 left to go first period as Spokane leads it one to nothing. Yeah, and I'm not, if I'm not mistaken, uh, Elenix outside the crease, so off the foot is okay in this league. Doesn't even look like the referees are going to even question it. Go upstairs to the video. Indeed, that's the one question I had. There was no... And look at all those missed opportunities as Yamamoto, right circle. Back it goes to Smith between the dots. Throws it on net. Puck loose out front. Hellenic with a rebound. Now Stanley for the loose puck in the paint. And picked up by McKenzie of Portland and shot down the ice. And that's the kind of play you want is a rebound and scramble. And then the Chiefs can bang it home. They can be physical in front. Smith now with the puck. Carries it up right side. Yamamoto with it. Over to Hellenic. Along the left circle, moves to the dock, cross ice. Anderson Dolan fanned on the one-timer, but got the puck back. Out to the blue line to Smith. 45 seconds left on the power play. Yamamoto with it, throws it out front, puck loose. Between the circles, Anderson Dolan gets to it. Back here, doesn't get through but it's on net and it hits some traffic in front and that creates the opportunity for Anderson Dole as the puck squirts out to his right he's able just to slide it on the ice to beat Kaler before Kaler could go down in the butterfly second goal in as many games in the defenseman but they never made it to him Smith quickly back into the Hawks zone but his space far side Fisher wrist shot scores found a little space on Kaler it goes high up over him and with 14.03 remaining in the third period Spokane's made it a one goal game. Well, that was an outstanding shot by Zach Fisher. Yeah, Smith brought in the zone. Bellows was there, but it got all the way through to Fisher, and he roofed it. High to the blocker side of Cole Kaler. His first of the playoffs. Fisher back in the lineup after being injured since February the 10th. And watching the play as Smith brought it in, and the Hawks looked like they had pretty good coverage. That was just a well-placed shot by Zach Fisher. Kaler, at the top of his crease, looked to have a read on it, but it beats him on the blocker side, and that's just it. Much like the Helgeson shot in the second period, it's a wicked shot that gets ahead of... McIndoo is there. Smith, Yamamoto, Anderson Dolan. Quick Ooh. shot, and he scores! Ooh. I don't know if Miner saw it, but the Chiefs are back in front, and it's a power play goal! Laser beam shot by J.A.D. there. Notice he does a great job here again of using the defenseman as a, as a screenshot. Waits and waits. Fires it right past him. You got a good angle here. Well, you can see Miner. Yeah. Now between Jeff DeWitt and uh, Kyler Yamamoto. Yamamoto has it right now to the midpoint for Smith. Onto the left circle. Anderson's Dolan wrist shot. Left pad save made by Outhouse. Anderson Dolan again. To Smith, faked the shot. Lost control, lost a handle, got it back. Now whips it to the right point for Yamamoto. Third power play of the game for the Chiefs. Ty Smith, left circle, lets Arister go, fought off, and the rebound, go right to Yamamoto, and he buries it. Adas made the save, the puck was loose, and Yamamoto finds it 
And he snaps it in. Johnny on the spot. 2-1 Chiefs lead here in the third. Well, Royals playing with fire there. That's the third penalty that they've taken in this game. And Kyler Yamamoto capitalizes off a nice juicy rebound. He's just circling around that net like a shark. Outhouse makes a pretty beautiful initial save and the rebound actually heads towards the left side of the net. Yamamoto's just Johnny on the spot and able to put it right past Outhouse there for a goal, now 2-1 Spokane. Now McGrew, and maybe things will be clearer after this weekend, we'll see. Face off in the Chiefs zone, Victoria. Kaspik wins the draw to the point, so a snapshot. It's off a body, the rebound booted by Kaspik, put it just wide. First attempt, couldn't get it on with the stick. Royals goal is empty. They've got 45 seconds, they need two to tie. Puck to Zumak. He'll find a man on the left wing, Elenik scores into the empty net. Well, last night they say it was a 7-3 game, the score not indicative of the game. Tonight it's 5-2, definitely not indicative no, of this, how this game went. This was a tightly checked game, and you can see a little bit of frustration for both teams. Both these 10 foot pass ahead, the frag drops it for Woods, silver tip zone. Laid one off right side, Smith to Woods, wrist shot, score! Riley Woods just sailed it through. And with 12-18 to go in period two, it sneaks its way right past the blocker's side of Dustin Wolf. And Woods picks up number 21 of the season. And this game's all tied at one. Now the Chiefs came through the neutral zone with some speed. They got it into the Everett end. And, you know, it wasn't exactly, I think, how they drew it up. The puck kind of drifted off sticks. But they were the first to get to it. And uh, coming off the bench, Ty Smith was very quick to get out there a quick change maybe a little bit jumped the gun but like i said the officials have let everything go like that so faith preoccupies him and now Chorney takes over on a pass to the far circle kept in now as a bouncing shot by helgeson is sent wide and picked up now left side by the silver tips and cleared back out now by kyle walker ty smith picks back up tips are finishing a change as now smith at the left boards Sails it from McKay into the corner. Broken up by Pilon. And wheel to the near side. Kept in by Yamamoto. Drops it back for Smith. On a toss left point. Dalton Hamaluck. Return back up high. Smith now cuts to his left. Looking for a lane. Good read by Wiley to cut it off. And deflecting now down low. Sent back up high by Yamamoto. Back to Smith who's shot knocked down. Rebound. Save made by Wolf. And a second chance. They score. Riley McKay in tight with 6.16 to go in period two. And after a remarkable save by Dustin Wolf, the tips unable to clear out in front. And McKay stashing in the rebound for number three of the season. And Spokane has taken their first lead at 2-1. Yeah, that little series kind of got away from the silver tips uh, right about when O'Rourke lost his stick. Right in front of the net, had it swatted out of his hands. There was some trading of the sticks. Girth gave him his and then he skated to the bench and got off and Pilon got on but it, uh, the assignments were kind of all over the place Wyatt Wiley was way out top guarding Smith he wanted the retreat got back down to his position but that left Smith all alone up at the blue line uh, it was uh, a lot of people unaccounted for and eventually McKay <laughs> play it ahead we'll know how this season's turned out in September won't we Jared Anderson Dolan against you with Yamamoto. Smith is there, jumped into the play, and Smith gets another goal! He jumped into the play, the third man on the break, and after two last night, he gets another one tonight. You might be looking at the Western Hockey League Player of the Week. Short side of the glove side, went upstairs. Berlin thought he had it, couldn't quite track. Kept in by Anderson Dolan, tied up by Andrusiak. Jumping in Lee, goes back blue line Smith, feed it across Yamamoto, goes high slot to Smith again. Now to Anderson Dolan, put a shot high off the boards. Yamamoto back on the left wing, sends it blue line to Smith. High shot on net, that one hit a high stick of a Spokane player. And Boy, Seattle should have let that puck go, let Spokane touch it because that face-up would have come outside the Seattle zone. Now it's tied up behind the T-Bird net. Now, that's hindsight. They probably didn't know whose high stick it went off. 
As they battle on the near boards, Spokane will work it back to Anderson Dolan. Feed it across, blue line to Smith. 45 on the power play. Yamamoto at the right circle. Back up top, Smith. Left circle, Anderson Dolan. Back back door, Yamamoto fires it in near post and scores. A power play goal makes it 3 0 Spokane. Yeah, you can see Yamamoto here on the near uh, the near face off. That was wide open, and Liam Hughes really committed there. A nice move by Anderson Dolan to draw Hughes over. Uh, and you could see that kind of in slow motion here. Yamamoto was just waiting for that pass. I think Anderson Dolan knew that's exactly where he's going to go, but he did a nice job faking Hughes out and pulling him towards him. So a power play go for Spokane on their 24th shot. Makes it 3-0 Chiefs late in the second period. It's the second period in which Spokane has scored late. Again, the tide was, it seemed like, starting to at least turn in Seattle's favor. And... The penalty, Spokane takes advantage of it to get another goal on the board. That was put in. Chiefs operating at, coming into this game at almost 26% against the Americans. Big shot from the point, stopped at the defense, but Woods has it. Cross ice, and another goal! And the Chiefs bang, bang, and have two to nothing on the goal by Ty Smith. And the song just barely ended. Well, that first power play goal gave them some energy right off the bat, and they took advantage of it and came right back. I don't know what it was in 20, 30 seconds at the most. You get good puck movement, open net, basically just buried it. Cross-size pass, Smith pinching in, got behind the defense. Topping didn't see him. Jerry, you see it backside. Really good patience, really good pass to... Uh... Thanks, AAA guys. Don't let car trouble follow your game day. Call 800-JOIN-AAA or visit AAA.com to unleash the power of membership. AAA, hero of the highway. AAA would like to remind you that driving distraction-free is the law. Welcome back, everyone. Right off the faceoff, Jared Anderson Dolan with a shot from the left wing, and he beats Dustin Wolf with 6.50 left to go in this third period, and the Chiefs have cut the lead to 3-1. to one. Power play goal for Anderson Dolan as the Chiefs going on the man advantage after the tripping call on Wiley at 13.03. Chiefs will get the goal at 13-10. His 33rd of the season, Ty Smith, Kyler Yamamoto with the assist. And Spokane on the board as they've got it to a 3-1 deficit. Americans had a five-on-three power play and scored on it. Now the Chiefs have one of their own. Smith for Anderson Dolan, who has the chief goal. Now Smith, as he steps up, the points will cross. Smith with a drive, and he scores. Ty Smith has tied it up. Good hard low drive, Ty Smith. So the five on three power play, and again, each team's had one. And we're knotted up at two. So Smith, that'll take the Gattenby penalty off. It'll be just Geeky in the box with that power play goal at 7.29 by Smith. A ninth goal left here in the period. Chiefs have tied the game at two. And they have the puck, Smith. Americans short five on four now. Chief power play looking to take the lead. Back to the point, Smith again. Yamamoto. Back at the point, Smith. Yamamoto in the circle. Yamamoto to the front. McIndoo, he scores. McIndoo with a layup there and a 3-2 lead. So the Chiefs go 2-2 two two there on those five-on-three power play, and they've turned this game around. Great puck movement. Yamamoto, no resistance here for McIndoo, just really a layup. Yeah, it looks like Beck warm up. Morgan Geeky, Americans down by two. Americans win the draw. Coglin point to point. Valamaki. Coglin midpoint. Steps up. Wrist shot. Save. Weatherill. Rebound. Bang to the net. Loose puck. Yaremko. Tipped wide. Coglin again. Shot blocked. Rolling puck. Coglin dives for it. Needs some help. 
But McAdoo says, I got it. Now for Anderson Dolan, can't get a shot through. Geeky the takeaway, and the Americans the puck. Back to the Americans transition, 70 seconds to go. Wenderill greets the puck behind the chief net, throws in the corner, Yaremko knocks it down. Loose puck Yamamoto, and he'll roll it out for Spokane. Minute to go, Malamaki. Americans trail by two, up for topping. Brings it into the Spokane zone, topping. Smack and do like a dog and a bone, forces a turnover. And Anderson Dolan with one man back. It's Coglin. He'll fire it right in the empty net and score. On the biggest face off of the game to the right of Carter Hart. Fontaine and Anderson Dolan. To the dot, the puck is dropped. Tips control. Kevin Davis looking right side. Got the clear. Down it goes. Well wide of the Spokane net. Then taken in behind by Yamamoto. 2.17 to go here in regulation. 1-0 tips. Elite toss Selenik into the silver tip zone. Right side Anderson Dolan. Backhander saved made by Carter Hart. Puck not cleared. Yamamoto has shot. Blocked by Dewar and kept in by Ty Smith. From the line to the right side Reed. Cross ice for Smith. Drags, sends one across. Played by Reed off the boards to the top for Smith. Right circle Elenik centering Anderson Dolan. He scores. Spokane has tied it up. One minute and 49 seconds to go in regulation. Jared Anderson Dolan is team leading 29th goal on the season as he finishes a centering pass between the circles. It's 1-1. Yeah, the two defensemen for Spokane out there, Reed and Smith, were sort of exchanging passes at the blue line, not in any hurry, and they finally had both Everett uh, forwards out there near them. They kind of enticed them to come out and play them. And once they saw that, they got the puck quickly over to Elinuk. Now, they're, they're getting nothing, unfortunately. And a face-off right circle. Fontaine wins it. Bicot to the back for Andre Valla from the blue line. Looking for Bicot, who curls right side. And a pass over to Fontaine. Now cuts toward his left. Shuffling it down low. And Vala into the corner, wipes out Ty Smith, and checked into the back by Yamamoto, but no call. 2.34 to go. Puck laid, far corner for Anderson Dolan. Tips back pedal as Anderson Dolan, behind his own net now, leads the attack to center ice, and cruising left wing into the silver tip zone. Peels off Andre Vala, sent one of the blue line for Smith with 2.14 to go. And now to the right side, Smith. Whips across ice to Yamamoto. Dropped it back. Left circle. Smith. Wrist shot for the win. Missed it wide. Rebound in front. And Yamamoto scores. Two minutes and two seconds left in sudden death overtime. That's how this one ends with the Spokane Chiefs stealing two points out of downtown Everett. Your final score off a bank shot from behind the goal line by Kyler Yamamoto. The Spokane Chiefs two, and the Everett Silver Tips one. Uh, tough break for the Silver Tips to be so close on one end and then to have the action come back the other end where really felt like the Silver Tips stayed with their men really well. Ty Smith fired one well wide. Bykoff peeled off Yamamoto. He expected the way the shot came in, he expected it to come off around the corner. Tried to get that one across to Brett Davis, and it hit a, hit a skate on the way into Davis's stick. And back go the Chiefs coming in. They score! Well, Ty Smith allowed to go right in top of the slot and beats Matt Berlin on the blocker side. And quickly here, it's a tie game. It's 1-1 calling. Right. Well, you know, uh, Alex Bear and uh, Davis went in. It was a two-on-one pass across, uh, hit the defenseman's skate, and uh, all of a sudden Spokane broke out, tough to defend. They had a four on two. As, uh, One stopped by Berlin, and the rebound's going to be taken by Hossinger. Now it's loose behind the net. Smart off the boards. He can't get it out as it's kept in by Yamamoto. Up top for Smith. Another sla uh, slap shot there, and that one didn't get through. A quick shot goes off the shoulder of Berlin as that one was let go by Yamamoto. Puck now up top, it's Smith. Near side for Anderson Dolan, puts it down low, a save there by Berlin. Puck on the end wall as Pouliot is in there. 
quite a few players in there. Now it goes to Anderson Dolan, plays it up top for Smith, and now near side Yamamoto. Yamamoto back for Smith, middle of the ice, over for Anderson Dolan. Puts it across there, what a feed, and what a goal. Yamamoto tapping that one in. It's a power play marker, and it's now 3-2. Well, I think it was only a matter of time. The Kootenai's had two or three opportunities maybe to get it out and uh, couldn't quite. Spokane kept it in and, uh, you know, a great pass from uh, Anderson. With one of the officials here. And, well, the puck has dropped as that's taking place. Yamamoto at the blue line leaves it for Smith and now near side Anderson. Dolan lets it go, post it in, he scores. What a night for Jarrett Anderson Dolan. That is point number four. It's a power play goal. Post and in beats Berlin glove side. And the Chiefs once again have the lead. It's now 4-3. Right. Uh, you know, the uh, just cross the blue line came across and uh, let a shot go. I'm not too sure if Berlin. GPT.com. Spokane on their first power play of this game. 18th in the league. And the tips have really frustrated in this entire series. Anderson Dolan to the top for Ty Smith. Right side, Yamamoto deflection in front, and McGrew scores. We were just going to get to the fact that Spokane was 1 of 19 on the man advantage against the tips. Make that 2 of 20 with pretty effective puck movement. And Jake McGrew gets a deflection upstairs with 9.45 to go in the first. And it's one nothing Chiefs. Yeah, it started simple enough with the puck movement just around the perimeter up top. Uh, it started though with a, a clean faceoff win. He's it since he's made some midterm uh, rankings there. So those two guys stand out to me. Left side Anderson Dolan, his shot wide. And on Spokane's third man advantage, they whip one of the top. Smith to Yamamoto, right side, cross ice. Anderson Dolan, wrist shot wide. And deflecting behind to Yamamoto. He walks out. Now straight away from the left. Dropping it for Smith, left circle, Anderson Dolan, cross ice to Yamamoto, who scores. Second power play goal for Spokane, and a three-point day for the Edmonton Oilers' first round pick. Kyler Yamamoto, a redirection from the right circle. It's 4-3 Spokane. Now we certainly know he's capable of these types of things. He was the administered a couple of the administered a couple times. I was feathered in a coin. Ty Smith, he's got it. Now Crawl with the rim. Taylor Crawl up the center ice. Up for Anderson Dolan. Scoots in left wing. AD comes to the net. Trailer. Smith shoots and scores. Smith on the bond. Slips it. Look like between the pads a day. And the Chiefs with a quick reply. Goal at 3.46. So Smith... From his knees. Caught off balance. And able to. Punched ahead by Jake McGrew. McGrew's had a good game here tonight with a goal. He centers one. Another centering pass. Tried to get it to Toporowski. He was kind of off balance there. Topping will just poke it with his hand. Dumps it into the zone. Chiefs will come back and get it. Smith, Fafrak will bring it up the wing. One of the two European players for Spokane. Centering pass, Toporowski! And Luke Toporowski with a spinorama! And the Chiefs have a 4-2 lead! Well, Luke's had himself a nice game. He deserves to be rewarded for it, and there he was. I'm going to tell you right now, he he fought like his dad fought early in this game. About to end, Chiefs with it on the near wall. That's McIndoo to Smith. Yamamoto walks in, power play over, deflected in front of the Chiefs score. It won't be a power play goal, but the Chiefs are going to take a 1-0 lead. Really, really good recognition by Kyler there. Set that up. Threw it to look like he was going to shoot it. Ends up passing off for an easy tip in. Kept his eyes open and just threw it to the front of the net. Looked like Jake McGrew got a stick on it in front. Well, that's pass all the way. And you go know Carter Hart's looking at Kyler thinking he's going to shoot it top shelf. Kyler. Set down by Weatherill behind the net. Chiefs will now bring it up as Smith. Through the neutral zone. Drop pass. Gives it for Anderson Dolan. AD across the blue line. Over to Smith. Back over to Anderson Dolan, left circle, back to the point to Smith. Smith fires it on net. Save rebound out front to Zumak, puts the shot on net. Zumak scores! 
Rutgers. Ethan Bakendu gets the second rebound and stops at home and Spokane on the board with 14.05 left in this first period. Zumak keeping that puck alive, that play alive after the shot from Smith from the point. Taylor not able to handle the rebound. Zumak pounding it back into his pads a couple times and McAdoo decides, well, that isn't working. Let's go up top and he gets her done. That goal at 5.55 of this first period as the Chiefs getting another $25 donated to Project Cherokee. Three to go in the game. A minute 38 left on the Spokane power play. Smith with it through the neutral zone up the left side. Drives it. Now holds it up. Plays it back up the wall to Anderson Dolan. He'll drive it down the wall. Back it goes to Smith. Right side to McGrew. Now to Anderson Dolan. Left side. Snap the shot. He scores! Get it, Anderson Dolan. Top shelf. Beats Taylor on the glove side. And Spokane, another power play goal as they take an eight to three lead. Special teams almost perfect tonight. This is just a, a clinic, both shorthanded and on the power play. He's just not scoring on only one of the power plays tonight. Impressive. That goal at 12:27 of the third period. Jared Anderson Dolan. Bouncing puck on the faceoff. Chiefs control it at the puck. Smith. He'll roll it around the boards. Krebs tied up back by the net. He'll bat it back to the point. Chiefs reset. Ty Smith. Out the left circle. Anderson Dolan fed to the front. Puck knocked down again. Zumak tries to get to it. He does and flings the puck by the net. Bishop. He strides in battling. McIndoo soccers it. Chiefs get it back to the point again. Traversing the line. Smith. Now for Anderson Dolan, tugs it on, save, rebound, scored. Okay, throwing their body around, and Anderson Dolan with a great shot. He just put it right in the bread basket. Off the faceoff, Smith snaps a quick wrister from the right circle, and a glove save by Warren. Helgeson, and Smith with the blue, and comes back to Smith, makes the move, comes in, deeps the shot, save made by Warren, rebound out front, Elena caps at it, it scores! Hudson Alenick tapped it into the pads of Warren, then put it back in on the second try, and Spokane on the board, 56 seconds into this game, it's 1-0 Chiefs. We heard Coach Lambert talk about this line needing to play better than last night, and they didn't waste any time here with not even a minute into the period. Face-off win, clean draw, and that gets the start. I love Alenick's patience in the crease to find the puck and just find a way to get it in. Bipko up the right side. Yuremko going to drop pass for Geeky. Geeky right side. Tries a shot. Blocked by Smith. And now here comes Elenick. It could be a three on two for Spokane. Elenick up the left side. Drives it on net. And the pass goes wide as Fisher will pick up the loose puck. Shifts it over to Smith. Smith moves in left side. There's five shot save made there by Warm. Smith with the puck. Out to Elenick. Elenick looking between the circles. Looks back to Smith. Shoots it. to Smith at the point. Smith back over right side. Shot to score! Oh, Sam Alenick from the right circle. And Spokane has cut this lead to 3-2 to with 13.32 to go in the third. And not only on the right circle, but the bottom half of the right circle, uh, almost to the goal line. So this is a, this is a situation where it's a one-timer, and you've got to thread the needle, and Alenick did just that on a great feed from Ty Smith. And that was the key. Ty Smith, the vision to get the feed there. Elenick just had to one-time it, and he did so. As Ty Smith is going to pick up his team-leading 32nd assist of the year. Elenick is team-leading 18th goal of the season. In the first three minutes of this game, Smith with it. Over to Anderson Dolan. 
He'll carry it up left side. Drops it back. Smith will pick it up. Right side. Zumak right circle. Moves in. Now going to back off. Back out to the blue line to Smith. Back to Zumak. He'll come over to Anderson Dolan. Open left side. Shoot that score! Jared Anderson Dolan. Far post. And Spokane is even this game at one with 16.46 to go in the first period. And I think Tyson Helgeson was down in front of the goaltender setting up the screen for the great shot by Jared Anderson Dolan from the left point. So a little bit of a swap for D for forward on that play, on the power play. Anderson Dolan rips one. But Credit goes to assistant coach Danny Flynn, who has done wonders on that shorthanded unit. On the ice now, Lane Gillis and Alex Overhart. It's controlled by Ty Smith, far side Tyson Helgeson. 4.30 remaining in the period. Shot by Helgeson doesn't get through. It's taken by Overhart in front of the net. Overhart pestered by Eli Zumak, rimmed around the boards far side by Teixeira, held in by Helgeson. Near side to Anderson Dolan, back towards the blue line to Smith. His shot tipped in front, goal. Looks like Eli Zumak by the way he's celebrating. And we'll see if it's a high stick. We may have a look, but our Chiefs have tied things up. Referee and signal goal. There has to be conclusive evidence to overturn it. Kaler made a motion like it might have been a high stick. Hard to tell from how quickly it entered the net from our position if it was deflected or not. But if it's ruled a good goal, it'll be Zumax power play goal to tie it at two. As Smith's point shot Zumak, it's, it was questionable. This might give us a better look. Now, I can't really tell from that angle either. It's got to be conclusive to overturn it. They're going to talk the official score. And again, not much he could do on those three goals. Face off control by the Chiefs. Helgeson shot, stopped by Kaler. Near side, Ethan McAdoo carries down below the goal line. Eli Zumak in the near corner. Chiefs set up shop. Right point, Helgeson now into the middle. For Smith, far side, Jared Anderson Dolan. His shot gets through a maze of bodies. Kaler redirects it to the far corner. Eli Zumak controls for the Chiefs. 45 seconds remaining on the power play for Spokane. Eli Zumak, left dot towards the line for Smith. His shot doesn't make it through. Rebound stopped by Kaler. What a left pad save by Kaler, kicking out that skate at the last possible moment. And the puck comes to center ice. Smith ahead for Zumak. Now finds Jared Anderson Dolan with his step. Anderson Dolan towards the net. Scores. What a shot by Anderson Dolan. Finds space above Kaler. And it still hasn't come down. That was retribution because Kaler robbed Anderson Dolan on a wrist shot prior on the man advantage. At that time, Anderson Dolan had speed around Ludwig at the blue line and went in and roofed it over Kaler. Time of goals 11.55 and now three consecutive power play goals for Spokane. After going scoreless in their first 27 opportunities against the Winterhawks this season, they've now got scored on their last three. And that's quite the shot. Ethan will now come out to join Reed up top. Zumak going to come out front with Elenick and Fisher. Elenick cross the blue line. Comes up right side. Drop pass. Comes to Ty Smith who came on the run. Comes over right side. Fisher shot. And it's good. Top shelf and Spokane on the power play has tied this game at one. Zach Fisher, 11 goals in his last 14 games. That's his 14th of the year. That goal will come at 11.43 of the first period as Spokane puts another $25 in the kitty of Project Share, courtesy of Avista. Boy, Woodsy had a great look. Missed the net. 5.54 left second period. Elenick along the wall to Fisher. Into the corner. Wiley around. Fisher the lone goal for Spokane tonight. Smith. Puts it on the end board where Woods is going to chase after it. Leave it for Fisher on the end wall. Out front for Elenick and deflected away. Comes to Smith who fires the shot. Puck loose out front and deflects just wide of the net. Fisher with it. Reed open. Shoots it. Goal! between the circles and Spokane has tied this game at two with 528 left in the second period. Woods was open
and down low, but Baker saw that Reed was open up top. And Reed made sure as he slipped it through for his 11th of the season. 14.32, the time of the goal. As Reed will get his 11th of the year, Ty Smith will get his second assist. And Dolan behind the net, left side, out the Helgeson blue line, over to Smith right side. In behind the net, Yamamoto, back out to Smith. Smith seeing the ice, turn, fire, shot block, comes to Elenick who just came on. That's a shot, he scores! as they lead it one to nothing with 5.19 left to go in the first period. Yeah, boy, Ellenick coming off uh, the bench as the Chiefs with offensive pressure. We'll just dump it in. Smith, Fisher. Fisher floats it to the open wing. First place in their player there is Helgeson off the stick of Lee, so no icing. Lee back to get it, ridden off the play by Woods. Woods walks in front, and there it is, Fisher's second goal of the night. He was wide open, and the floodgates have opened, and the Chiefs have taken the T-Birds to the woodshed. Again, the puck's just moving too, puck's just moving too fast for Seattle to keep up with it. Look at Woods just walked in front, Fisher calling for it, he got it, nobody there. He was all alone on the far post. Seattle defenseman without his stick behind the net. Neither of those are good. You don't want to be behind the net, number one. And number two, you don't want to be without the stick. Americans 4-4 four four in the Sunshine Collision PK. Here's Smith with a shot right on. Puck dribbles in the net and it dribbled in. So that one dribbled across the line, trying to get to it. Puck changed direction, and it looks like Ethan McAndrew changed enough of direction on that puck. And the game tied at three. So the goal took six, uh, make that seven seconds. He'll bring it back to the point again, hangs on to the puck, steps away, comes to the circle, back door, tucked at the post. Anderson Dolan hit the side of the net. Anderson Dolan again for Smith. Hangs on to it, midpoint. Now Yamamoto crosses, takes it, comes to the right circle, looks for room, backdoor feed and scores. Smith ends it with a game-winning goal. Chiefs with their first win this year against the Americans and their first win in over a year here in Toyota Center. The shot just wide right, comes up the right wall. Wood sends it down the board. Waters able to get ahead to Gothel. Gothels from the red line, intercepted by Anderson Dolan, gets it to Smith, middle of the ice. Smith up the left side, making a move up the wall. Now holds the puck, back it comes to Helgeson, puts a shot on it, and a score! Jeff Bates with the tip out front, and Spokane now with a 6-2 lead with 10-12 remaining here in this third period. That was all Ty Smith getting the puck deep, controlling the play, drawing in a couple of players. Then he makes a good pass to his position out at the point. Helgeson gets it on net. Faith in. Ty Smith with a racer from the point goes top shelf and Spokane on the board with 16.26 left in the first period. It's one nothing, Chief. Well, Spokane takes advantage on their first power play chance. Smith going to knock Smith and Helgeson defensively. Mahura with a shot left side. Blocked away by Woods. Puck off the wall. Woods gets it out. And here comes Anderson Dolan for a breakaway. Anderson Dolan down the middle. Here comes in. Back in. Anderson Dolan. Behind the net. Out it goes Anderson Dolan to the point to Smith. Smith. Over to Anderson Dolan, right circle, out front, looking for a stick, could not connect, and Zumak leaves it back out to Smith at the left blue line. Anderson Dolan, right circle, makes a move, drop pass for Smith. Back it goes to Anderson Dolan, looking, back it goes to Smith. Smith goes over to Fisher, back over to Smith. Penalty coming here on Regina as a shot out front, rebound, score! Eli Zumak bangs it home. And Spokane with another power play goal. 15-35 remaining.
remaining in the second period, and the Chiefs now lead it by a score of three to nothing. Back to the point. Smith turns, fires a shot, deflected wide right. Anderson Dolan back with it. Off the wall. Back to Smith at the blue line. Smith looking. Goes over to Zumak left side. Now to Smith, turn, fire shot, scores! Riley Woods may have tipped that out that front, and he did. And Spokane now with a 4 nothing lead with 13. Knocked away from him by Vanderbilt. Prefontaine gets credit for the lone assist on the goal by Elmer. Yamamoto, cross ice pass for Smith. He'll move in right boards, gets through Cox. Makes another move, now curls right side. Centers all the way back for Helgeson. Left circle, shot, scores! Just like that, it's 1-1. Yeah, I think that hit a body in front as well. It was just a perfect shot by Helgeson at the point. But there was a, a Lethbridge Hurricane that was laying right beside the net. And it felt like that probably went in off him. Kind of almost hit his backside. We'll have to take a look at the replay on that one to see if that's exactly what happened. But sure enough, it, yeah. Is that Addison, I think? Yeah, it hit Addison. He gets knocked down and is laying beside the crease. Otherwise, that shot's going wide. Reed gets it back. Cross ice. Anderson Dolan ripped it wide. Reed gets it on the right wing to the blue line. Smith for Anderson Dolan. Went off the heel of his stick to the corner. Yamamoto after it. Leaves for Anderson Dolan, a minute to go in the period. Puck back to the line, Smith. Right side, Reed, point shot, save Skinner. Puck to Yamamoto. Tyler Yamamoto, bottom of the right circle. Puts it cross ice, it bounces back to Smith at the line. Ty Smith, a shot, he scores! A seeing eye wrist shot by Ty Smith. And it's five to two, Spokane. Yeah, that's going to be the fourth point of the night for Kyler Yamamoto as well. He's the one that threw it back to the point. Nice play by him, too, to just kind of throw it back to the point off the boards as well. The pass wasn't there, so he throws it off the boards. Ty Smith's just able to walk into the center. And look who's screening in front. It's Kyler Yamamoto. <laughs> Somebody's... Minute 50 to go, third period. Smith will get it across, and Reed will take it ahead. Pass for Fisher. Look out, breakaway. Fisher in. Zach Fisher scores! A turnover at center, Fisher moves in and seals it. It's 6-3 Spokane. And good hands on that one by Zach Fisher as well. We see why he was such a goal scorer in Medicine Hat last year and the Chiefs were so excited to get him. Sure enough, that's a breakaway from the red line in. Good back checking there on that one by Josh Tarswell, but Fisher just stuck with it. Smith back in his own zone, leaves it off for Fisher, chips it for Smith. Now Elenick, cross-ice pass, knocked away. Picked up by Geeky, goes back to Johnson. Johnson taken off the puck by Elenick. And now Fisher to Elenick, drop pass to Fisher. Fisher cross the blue line. Fisher, drop pass, Smith, left circle. Goes it on that save, rebound on the... Goal! Patrick with the rebound. And a first Western Hockey League goal as the Chiefs have tied this game at two. With 9.15 to go in the third period. Well, your first goals are rarely the highlight material. They're usually the... Comes up the left wing all the way at the top of the circle. We'll give it to Smith. He'll come down the left wing. He'll come towards the net. He'll backhand it. That went off the sack. Which loose puck. Scores. Elena got the loose puck and chopped it off the pad of Anders and in, and it's 2-0 Spokane. A great example of if you get the puck to the blue paint area, the, play, the person trying to do it is Smith. He doesn't score, but one of his teammates is able to find the puck. Actually, it was the second effort. The first save by Anders. The second puck went up over top of his pad behind the net, and on 4-4 four and four play, on their seventh shot, the Spokane Chiefs get their second goal, and I think it's Hudson Elwood with his second as well. It will be. Teague might be catching up to this team a little bit, not to make any excuses for them, but... No, that's a good point, though. They have played a ton of hockey, more more games than anybody else in the league right at this point. Travel, and they they practice a lot. Here's Smith. Long shot deflected in front. They score. Ty Smith from the line. I think it will hit Elenick on the way in. It's 5 nothing Spokane. Well, that's a terrific redirection. Uh, Elenick standing at about the bottom hash mark, uh, the closest one to the net. 
And that shot coming in from the point, he's able to redirect that one. Yeah, I mean, that shot was going well wide, and Elnick reaches out and redirects it on net, and it goes in on the far side of the goal. Not a lot Boston below us could do on that one. Everything is a bit traffic around below us all night, too. Yeah. We'll take the face off. Wins it back to Smith. Over to Elenick. Now Anderson Dolan left side at the blue line. Dishes it back to Smith. Smith over to the right side. Elenick right circle. Throws a shot on net. Block. It comes to Anderson Dolan. Outer hash is right circle. To the point to Smith. Back to Anderson Dolan. Comes in between the circles. Yeah, Anderson Dolan. a nice give and go from Elenick to AD there and he walked walked into the top of the circles uh, pretty pretty much untouched ripped one it looked like five hole to me Mike it'll be Anderson Dolan on the face off gets it to McGrew out to the point to Smith Smith with it now cycles in between the circles gets it over to McGrew McGrew had to field a left circle fires a shot that goes just off the left side of the cage and the puck cleared by Victoria well McGrew got himself a good look there here comes Smith out of his own zone up the left side Anderson Dolan back it goes to Smith Smith over to Anderson Dolan Chiefs last in the league on the power play as Anderson Dolan the shot rebound goes over Be happy with you're listening to the Spokane Chiefs on the Inland Northwest's home for the most local sports, Sports Radio 1510 KGA Spokane. Blue line, Smith with it, Zumak with it. Lost signal for a second. We're back as McGrew shot from the left side, and he scores! Jake McGrew goes far post as the power play expired, and the Chiefs have reestablished a three-goal lead at 6-3. to three. Well, again, the Chiefs score just as the power play expired. Uh, really, if you add a second to the clock a couple of times, they're three for three. Good not. Picked up by Ken Dopp of Everett. His centering pass intercepted by Smith, who immediately sends it ahead for Anderson Dolan. AD up the right side, makes the move right circle, leaves it back. Helgeson open, shoots and scores! Hi, Fred Helgeson trailing the play, snaps it home, and Spokane has retaken the lead at 4-3. Now up ice. Anderson Dolan through the neutral zone. AD across the blue line, left side. Leaves it out to Elenick. Now Smith at the point. Smith holds it. Over to Elenick, left circle. Back it goes to Smith. Anderson Dolan, right side. Elenick, left circle. Out front. Anderson Dolan, back to Smith. Smith right side. He scores! Hey, Noster with the tip out front. And the Chiefs get on the board with 4.36 left of the second. It's now a 2-1 to one game. Minute 20. Chiefs win the draw back to the point. A shot there. That one was blocked in front by McIndoo. The shot unleashed by... And the Chiefs get on the loose puck back to the point. Three seconds left in the Kohler minor. He's going to come out right now. So it's over. A shot. And they score. Ty Smith. Let that one go from in between the top of the circle and the blue line. It was to the neutral zone area where it's now taken by LeDuc for the Chiefs. He puts that one up. And Houston gets it inside his own blue line, chips it out. Back and forth they go here. Someone trying to take control. Now it's Zumak is shot. And that one from a bad angle went top blocker, but it was wide. Puck rims around the boards where the ice are going to take this. It is Ryan Pouliot. He steps into the center ice area, tries to... Get a backhander into the zone. He can't. And now back come the Chiefs. A shot there. McKay. He scores. Riley McKay from the near side circle in the ice zone. 
The puck is dropped in the faceoff one by the Chiefs. A shot from the point, and that one deflected just wide as Birkin was looking for it high, and it went low. A quick shot out in front, rebound, and they score! Riley Woods collects a rebound off the pad of Bailey Birkin with 30 seconds left to go, and he's able to slide it under the ice netminder. 5-5. Well, a lot of times when you're trying... Left side going wide against Gallagher, but lost his footing, trying to get around that Spokane defenseman at the bottom of the left circle. Now back comes Spokane through center with numbers. Maybe a three on two. Smith right side delays, walks in. Ty Smith goes across, ripped and scored by Nolan Reed on the left wing, blasting it past the glove of Goche. And just two minutes and 48 seconds into the second, Spokane makes it 3 1. Well, this was Smith again setting up the play with each team down a man. And then there was that great shot by Nolan Reed. But it was Smith bringing the puck in putting on the brakes, going into the slot, and then delivering a pass at the top of the left face-off circle, a one-timer by his defensive partner, Nolan Reed, and before Gothi had a chance to really set himself up in goal. ...to get up, but meanwhile, back in on left wing is Boyd, fed on the shot in the circle, and then he taps it back behind the net with his back to the goal. Helgensen wraps it around to the right side. Cougars forechecking hard here. Leopard on for Nikita Papagai, who went off after got... A hard hit from Helgensen at his own blue line. Back to Mulberg, it goes right point. That's stopped by Weatherill with the butterfly save. No, breakaway pass. Ross ahead, scores! Out of nowhere, Taylor Ross gets the breakaway pass at the Prince George blue line. And 12.30 to go in the first period. Spokane, glove side for Taylor Ross, makes it 1-0. Well, Ross took that pass from the Spokane end. He was past the red line. As we take a look, he cut in, it was just him against the Grant, and he went high. do in the corner, back in behind the goal. It's now played up top to Cole, trying to go back down for Woods on the right wing wall. Missed the puck, that allows the Cougars to grab it, and Josh Anderson clears it 200 feet. Look at this, the work flying in on the shorthanded forecheck. Goes after the puck and now pokes it out to the center, but right to a Spokane chief player in Fafrak. The Slovakian will try to bring it back in on right wing, but then he turns it over on the wall. And Mazur will look it back to the red stripe, and it's knocked down by Ty Smith with the glove just inside his own end. Last call here for the power play for Spokane. Ty Smith in on the right side, puts the brakes on the half wall. Five seconds to go in the man, and then it's across left wing. Back in front, they score. Elenuk on the glove side on a quick tic-tac-toe. And it's 3 nothing at the tail end of the power play for Spokane. And Smith will draw the second assist on that goal. Again, he started the play. One second left. Elenek scores from the right face-off circle. So great three-way passing there. He just took it when it was on his stick, released it right away before Tavon Grant had a chance to set up. This goal comes at the 8.45 mark. And special teams continue to be the big difference in this game. Well, they needed that as we head to the close to the end of the second period. Off the draw, comes to Ty Smith in front, and he rifles it in for Spokane on a broken play, right point shot. Ty Smith rifles it over the glove of Grant, and just like that, with 58 seconds left, Spokane restores the three-goal lead. It's 4-1. to one. Well, he's been the best chief. I've mentioned all game long, and, and he's a very, very special hockey player. Ty Smith, two assists earlier, and this time he is positioned right into the slot, unguarded. That puck was on his stick, and he let it go before Grant even had a chance to move. Just like that on the one-timer from Smith, the Chiefs are ahead by a 